Tonight we are making short rib for dinner tonight. And here are the ingredients. We're gonna start out with sear the meat. So we're gonna add, I'm adding some vegetable oils in here and let it heat up for about 30 seconds. You can actually buy this rib at any store. We're gonna go ahead and cook these vegetables. Again, I'm gonna add a couple tablespoons of oil. You can use any kind of oil you like. And then I'm gonna, um, I'm not gonna wait, so I'm gonna go ahead and add some garlic in here. Okay, I'm getting ready to add the vegetable, but at this time, you turn on your oven, uh, preheat for 325. So I'm gonna go ahead and add all the vegetable in. Cook it for at least about three minutes. All right, so now we're gonna add some salt and pepper, black pepper. As much as you like, it's up to your taste. So I'm adding two big tablespoons of flour in here. Okay, what the flour does is gonna thicken the sauce. And then we're gonna add couple tablespoons of these in here. So now I'm going to add the beef broth in here. Now I'm going to add some red wine in here and again it's up to you. Um, we like it a lot, especially with beef. It's really good. Now I'm getting ready to put the ribs in here. I'm gonna bring it to boil before I add the um, short ribs in here. So before I come to boiling, I'm gonna go ahead and add some thyme and dry bay leaf in here, okay? So this is good enough now, so it's boiled. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the meat in here. So now we're going to put this in the oven, 325, for two and a half hours. So today, I made quite a bit. Alright, so the rib is done. I'm going to get it out and see how it looks. 